How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. Today, I'm going to show you guys the best free VPN for unblocking the OME TV ban. So if you're uh, banned on OME TV for whatever reason, uh, whether it's a justified ban or not, you are able to uh, get yourself unblocked using a VPN. Now, obviously, there are free VPN options and there are paid VPN options. Now, typically, I wouldn't recommend a free VPN because of the restrictions and the fact that most free VPNs collect information on their users and sell it to third party companies, resulting in a lot of spam emails and, and just adware and things that you really don't want to be dealing with. Now, if I were to recommend a free VPN, it would certainly be Proton VPN, and Proton VPN is going to be a great VPN overall. But the problem is, is that you're restricted to only three countries because the paid servers are going to be behind a paywall. So you have Japan, Netherlands, and the United States. Now, the cool thing about Proton VPN is that it's a safe VPN and they won't collect your information because they're independently audited. Uh, so there's proof that Proton VPN does not collect information on their users. So that's a great thing, which makes it a safe VPN for you to use. And there are no bandwidth limitations. So you can use Proton VPN as much as you would like. Now, obviously, with Proton VPN, you're not going to be able to unblock streaming services. You're not going to be able to download torrents and your speed will be hindered because, you know, they're free servers. They're, for the most part, quite a bit congested. As you can tell, most of them are 80% plus 70. And at times, there are a lot of them, about half of them could be at 98, 99, and sometimes 100%. So in terms of speed, they're not going to have the best speeds. And you're definitely going to suffer a little bit in terms of upload speed. And since OME TV uh, relies on upload speed and download speed, you're not exactly going to be having the best speeds. But obviously, you know, if you want to use a free VPN, this is a great VPN and the moment I'm connected here just want to show you guys so previously I was just connected to a Spanish server using a NordVPN okay so we're just going to go ahead and enable that and see what happens here now obviously it may take a little bit of time this is a free VPN after all so you might just have to give it its own time to connect you to a server and now that I'm connected let's go ahead and check out the IP finder right here refresh and it should show that I'm somewhere in the United States now that I'm connected to a United States server and as you can tell it shows that I'm in Los Angeles California and with this new IP address you can connect to OMA TV and you should be good to go now if you're looking for a paid option I would definitely recommend one of the top three VPNs so I've tested over a couple of dozen VPNs and I've narrowed it down to these three is the best overall they all vary in budgets and features, so pick and choose depending on your own situation and what you're looking for out of your VPN and your own preferences and budget, of course. So if I were to connect using one of these VPNs, just to show you guys the difference here, first of all, you have plenty of locations, over 3,000 servers in 94 countries with ExpressVPN, over 5,600 servers in 59 countries with NordVPN, and over 3,200 servers in 100 countries with Surfshark. And as far as connecting, you know, it's not going to take as much time you're going to be able to use the fastest protocol and as you can tell connecting is only taking just a second or two and i'll go back to um the server or ip finder right here and it will show that i'm in chicago illinois and of course you have plenty of options with regards to security servers and overall reliability and consistency is going to be very high with these vpns unlike when using a free vpn so either way, if you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing discounts in the description down below, as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn more about the privacy policy, speed streaming, and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. And of course, they're all covered by a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you can test drive these VPNs for 30 days risk-free. Otherwise, you can simply get yourself the refund if you're not satisfied. And that is pretty much how you can unblock yourself from OME TV. Just connect to a server, and uh, that way you'll pick up a new IP address, and you can get right back to OME TV. So come below if you have any questions i'll be happy to answer all of them like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything vpns and cybersecurity thank you guys very much for watching and i'll see you in the next one have a wonderful day